Iceland country profile Capital, Reykjavik Population, 339,031 Total size, 103,000 square kilometers World region or continent, Arctic region Type of government, Constitutional Republic Languages spoken, Icelandic, English, Nordic languages, German widely spoken Independence, December 1, 1918, became a sovereign state under the Danish crown, June 17, 1944, from Denmark Religions, Lutheran Church of Iceland 85.5%, Reykjavik Free Church 2.1%, Roman Catholic Church 2%, Hafnar Fjora Free Church 1.5%, Other Christian 2.7%, Other Oran Specified 3.8%, Unaffiliated 2.4% Currency, Icelandic Krona, ISK Agricultural Products, Potatoes green vegetables, mutton, dairy products, fish natural resources, fish, hydro <laughs> major exports, fish and fish products 70%, aluminum, animal products, ferrosilicon, diatomite major imports, machinery and equipment, petroleum products, foodstuffs, textiles Iceland is an island country in the northern Atlantic Ocean. It is considered a part of Europe. The settlement of Iceland began in the year 874 AD when a Viking chieftain from Norway, Ingolfur Arnarsson, became the island's first permanent settler. More Norwegians some Scandinavians as well followed through the centuries. The parliament is the oldest in the world and is called the Althingi. In 1262, Iceland united with Norway. Later, the country joined with Norway and became a part of the Danish crown. When Norway later became independent again, Iceland remained united with Denmark. In 1875 Iceland suffered a terrible natural disaster with the eruption of the Askja volcano. The country experienced widespread famine and the economy was devastated. Over the next 25 years, 20% of the population left the island. In 1918 Iceland became an independent state with some remaining ties to Denmark. Iceland would govern itself, but Denmark would handle foreign relations and defense. During World War I Iceland's defense was taken over by the United States. In 1944 Iceland became an independent republic and in 1946 the U.S. no longer was responsible to defend Iceland. However, in 1951 the two countries once again came to a defense agreement. Iceland is the only NATO member with no military of its own. During the final quarter of the 18th century approximately 20 to 25 percent of the population of Iceland immigrated to the United States and Canada because of famine in the country. The world's first democratically directly elected female president was an Icelander. Vigdis Finnbogadóttir was elected in 1980. Joanna Sigurdóttir became Iceland's first female prime minister in 2009. Iceland was the last land in Europe to be settled and populated. It is the youngest country in the world in terms of land form. Iceland is the 18th largest island in the world and Europe's second largest island after Great Britain. Reykjavik, the capital of Iceland, is the northernmost national capital in the world. Approximately 60% of the country's population lives in Reykjavik. East Iceland has the country's largest forest, lush farmlands, and many natural harbors with fishing villages. The south coast is home to some of the nation's most visited tourist attractions, including the Golden Circle. Dettifoss Waterfall is the most powerful waterfall in Europe. East Iceland is one of the island's most geologically diverse regions with one of the greatest concentration of geysers in the world as well as the famous Snæfellsjökull glacier. North Iceland has dramatic lava fields and hills carved out by rivers with turbulent waterfalls. The small fishing town of Husavík is the whale-watching capital of Europe. The Reykjans lava fields are a geothermal wonder and a beautiful place where lighthouses outnumber villages. About 30% of Iceland is lava fields. The famous Blue Lagoon are found here. 
Botna Yorkel Glacier is the largest ice cap in Europe. It is actually larger than all the other glaciers in Europe combined. Iceland has many geysers. The English word geyser is derived from Iceland's famous geyser. Today geyser doesn't erupt often, but nearby Straka erupts every 8 to 10 minutes. In the south of Iceland a volcano in Eyjafjallajökull erupted on March 21, 2010 for the first time since 1821, sending 600 people fleeing. More eruptions in April forced hundreds to abandon their homes. The ash clouds were a major disruption to air travel across Europe. Parts of the country are often shaken by tremors and earthquakes of varying intensity. Volcanic eruptions and earthquakes follow each other. Iceland was ranked as the 13th most developed country in the world in 2013 by the UN's Human Development Index. The Icelandic people are descended from the Norwegian Vikings founders and native Celtic populations of Scotland and Ireland who were captured and brought as slaves to the island. The people of Iceland have a seriously strong work ethic, working some of the longest hours of any industrialized country in the world. They value independence and self-sufficiency. Iceland has no standing army, but the Coast Guard maintains the Iceland air defense system and patrols coastal waters. The police forces carry no guns. The national sport of Iceland is handball. The Icelandic men's team ranked among the top 12 in the world. The main traditional sport is called glima which is a form of wrestling thought to be from medieval times. Football, soccer, is the most popular team sport. Icelanders' festivals and holidays celebrate church or ancient Norse traditions. These include Bondadajur, Husband's Day, and Therablat, a midwinter celebration based on an ancient pagan sacrificial winter fest. John's Mass celebrates Midsummer Night. As many as 80% of the population of Icelanders still believe in the existence of elves. Puffin is considered a local delicacy. It is prepared through broiling and served shredded. Raw puffin heart is considered a delicacy. Puffins are listed by the Yukon as an endangered animal, so keep that in mind before you dine. Lamb is by far the most commonly eaten meat and is served either smoke-cured hanhik jot, or salt-preserved, salt jot. Side dishes include mashed or boiled potatoes, green beans and rye bread. Like, share and subscribe to Sitter's Lifestyle.